This is Dabu7. You may recall back in 2011, there were concerns over rising floodwaters on the Missouri River that were affecting multiple different nuclear stations along the river. One of them was the Cooper Nuclear Station near Brownville, and this was in Nebraska. Right now, they're saying that workers are bolstering a levee with sandbags and making other preparations to try to stop any flooding from coming in to this facility. Do you can see where the water is right here in concerns to this. And also to make note of this uh, information here that although the plant operator is insisting that there's no danger, it's worth noting that the Cooper Nuclear Station uses a GE or General Electric Mark I boiling water reactor, identical in design to the four reactors that were flooded and subsequently exploded eight years ago during Fukushima. Now, of course, it was a massive tsunami and an earthquake associated with that that did a lot of damage in Japan. But the main thing here is that the floodwaters did severe damage in shutting things down. And it also destroyed backup power generators. That's one of the key things here. You got to keep that going. If you lose that, that's when they run into a bunch of other issues. We've seen this in the past. So with the swelling rivers, this is something to keep an eye on. We're just now getting on the cusp of spring and all the snow melt off is yet to even come out of the Rockies or anything else in other areas, Pacific Northwest, and where all this water is running down and out of. So this is something we're going to have to continue to watch here and monitor if things change, I'll continue to update. Make sure to follow me on Twitter for the latest updates and also join us for Underground World News Live, 8 p.m. Eastern, every Friday night on Dabu 77. Much love, y'all.